Most of the highly specialized research at the University of Arizona is an art in and of itself. But University Distinguished Professor Michael Brian Schiffer is taking that art one step further. Because I'm an archaeologist and I started out as a southwestern archaeologist where we have all this wonderful pottery, I, I was familiar with some of the issues that archaeologists had in the study of pottery and I built a, an experimental laboratory for studying pottery back in 1983 with the help of some graduate students. One of our major projects back in the late 80s and early 90s is to look at the effects of traditional surface treatments like texturing and burnishing and, uh, and slipping and polishing to see did, did those surface um, techniques have an effect on how pottery is actually used. And we found out that in fact uh, surface treatments affect a lot of what we call performance characteristics during use, such as how quickly a pot, a cooking pot heats up its contents. And so it helps us to explain, for example, why traditional cooking pots don't have slip and polish on the exterior surfaces, because those tend to be susceptible to spalling and other kinds of damage. And then... Schiffer has hollowed out a corner in the anthropology department's laboratory of traditional technology for his potter's wheel, which he uses to help educate his students and throw the occasional pot. I started making pottery when I was a senior in college at UCLA, and I was fortunate enough to get into a ceramics class taught by Laura Andresen, who had founded the department and was already a famous potter, although I didn't know that at the time, because being an ignorant undergraduate, you never pick up on those things. She taught me some basic skills, and I watched the graduate students at work, and I realized that I really loved making pottery, and I especially loved using the wheel. I slowly accrued the equipment to be able to make pottery myself. And uh, like I say, only in, uh, about 10 years ago did I actually begin to do it in a serious way. But I had accumulated the equipment and every now and then made a pot and demonstrated it to classes and so forth. If you would like to purchase one of Schiffer's works, stop by the Howery Anthropology Building on campus either Friday, April 11th, or Saturday the 12th, starting at 9 a.m. All of the proceeds benefit the Louis and Francis Farah Schiffer Scholarship Fund.